Bill, I did want to take the opportunity to talk about your performance. It's been a, um, a week which many people have reported on your funds performance, and I think it's only right and only fair that we give you the opportunity and the right to respond to some of what has been criticism um, of your strategy. Can you just walk us through what did happen this week, Bill, and how you set up coming out the other side? Well, yeah, uh, give me some time on this. And, and the strategy, basically, which was the basis of your question, has been a, a strategy that has uh, been short the uh, German Bund and uh, long uh, U.S. Treasuries. You know, the, the spread between the two is historically high. Uh, for instance, on, on the 10-year U.S. Treasury versus the 10-year Bund, it's uh, 250 basis points. It's never been at that level. And for those that would cite uh, inflation differences, I would say, you know, in terms of the linker market uh, for Bunds and the tips market for U.S., on the five-year basis, uh, real yields on five-year tips are, are 220 basis points difference, 2.2% higher in the U U.S. than in Germany, and I would suggest that at some point, um, you know, this has got to reverse because the, the two, Germany and the United States, are equal credits. And what's the difference is simply the, the, the function between the ECB in terms of their monetary policy and the Fed in terms of their monetary policy. And so, um, you know, that was the basis for the, uh, you know, the, the bad day and the bad trade, but uh, certainly not the basis for some of the negative publicity from the New York Times that intertwined my uh, financial trade with my divorce of six to 12 months ago. I, I think it was outrageous, and I can talk about that, but you probably prefer to talk about some other things.